I am near my observatory and looks like the sky is clear. I think it is clear until tonight, maybe around 1 in the morning. So, we all had that excitement. Uh, you know, we took the pictures of Venus and Jupiter when they are close to each other. I mean, if you can see barely over there, uh, you can see the Venus on uh, Venus on the top, I believe Jupiter in the bottom, right, those you can still see them and uh, moon is of course very bright, it's full moon and uh, now I'm trying to take pictures of these galaxies, uh, these are a group of galaxies, there are so many of them, uh, if you look at the cluster is made of 1300 galaxies. It is called Virgo cluster. It is in the Virgo constellation and these are 63 million light years away from earth. Uh, there are few galaxies, at least uh, maybe 80 to 100 of them uh, that actually we can take pictures of and um, when you actually start looking at them or try to plate solve them, you might even see like 25 to 30 galaxies in one, one frame. The Virgo cluster I was talking about is uh, using this telescope. So, if you see the front of the telescope, I have a QHY 367C camera. Uh, so, this one is a full frame color camera and this is what I wanted to use. I didn't review, I didn't go over this camera at all. I moved here 18 months ago, I have been still in the transition, um, not settled well yet, uh, still a lot of stuff to complete. Uh, so, I didn't actually have really any time to go over the equipment to do anything else. So, I am taking some pictures, posting some videos, but that is pretty much it. But anyway, I hope I am coming back to the slowness and settling down of this place very soon. So, anyway, coming back to this, this is the QHY 367C and uh, at some point of time, I am going to review this filter slider system, but just to give you uh, idea, uh, this is the badder uh, planetarium uh, filter slider system for RAS 11. They do have the similar systems for like C14, C14 with Hyperstar, RAS 8. Uh, they have these pretty good arrangements like so many adapters. Uh, so, we have to figure out like which ones will work with the RAS 11 and then if you order the right parts, uh, then pretty much it gives you the correct back focus very precise back focus that you need and the one that I really like is the filter slider system that they have. So, these uh, filters here, the ones that you are seeing, uh, it does come with a, I believe these are 55 centimeters uh, filters like uh, essentially these are little bit bigger than the 2 inch. Uh, they work with the full frame and reduce vignetting as much as possible, but the full frame cameras are very big, uh, the, fam the frame itself, the sensor itself. So, I, I still see some vignetting using these, uh, but I think when I take flats, it is going away, it is not that bad. So, Virgo cluster is going to come in the east, uh, so the moon goes up a little bit, probably in like an hour or so. It is like roughly um, 7.15 right now. So, the better view for me is like maybe in 2 hours, like 9.15, the moon goes up and then the Virgo cluster starts rising up. I will quickly show you guys how this uh, picture is going to come. Uh, if you have not subscribed to my channel, 
I take pictures of uh, space. So if you are interested, uh, feel free to subscribe into my channel. Thank you. Thank you.